if you've got an ingrown toenail, you're in trouble. Check out these videos to see what happens when you have them removed. Are you suffering from the discomfort of pain and an ingrown toenail? Don't worry, there's a solution. It's called ingrown toenail removal. And this, these videos are gonna show you how it's done by professionals. Podiatrist is cleaning and clearing the way to remove the sliver of nail that's causing the ingrown nail to get infected. Firstly, the podiatrist will numb the area around the affected toe, so don't worry, you'll have local anaesthetic, and this ensures you won't feel, a, feel any pain during the surgery. Once the toe is numb, the doctor will carefully lift a corner of the ingrown toenail that's embedded into the skin and using specialised tools and will gently separate the nail from the inflamed tissue. You can see here we've got an infected toenail, so not only is it ingrown, there's pus to come out of the nail too. What's really important is to make sure you clean that, all that infection out before you start removing the ingrown piece of nail. I always recommend to all my patients to make sure you keep the toe and the skin all around it as clean as possible before you go and get the removal done. So once the, the whole area is nice and clean, the podiatrist will then gently uh, guide the ingrown nail piece out. And as you can see, when it comes out, it comes out in one piece. That's a, a large ingrown toner that's been causing a lot of pain. So this ingrown toenail, they're actually removing a, a partial sliver of nail. So this is a partial nail avulsion where they remove a side of the nail. So it's going to be a thinner toenail in the long run. You can't rush ingrown toenails. It's really important to make sure you go really steady and slow so you can get the ingrown nail out in its entirety. And remember, you will have uh, some sort of anaesthetic so your toe will be numb. You'll feel some pushing around, but it's, it's painless. So the professional here is doing the other side of the nail too. Uh, this is coming out a lot easier. You can see it's coming out in one piece. There it goes. So the nail, both sides now have been removed from those painful crease areas of the big toe. They always make sure they don't leave any pieces of nail or hard skin behind. So this toenail is a little bit different. You can see it's really thickened and very discoloured. This has been an ingrown toenail and also a very thickened toenail with a toenail infection. That's why it's so discoloured. Maybe this might have been caused from injury. Often this is the case and it's pretty loose at the nail base. So this one's going to be removed. The whole nail's going to go and the nail bed's going to be exposed. This takes a lot longer to heal. I would say about eight weeks before you get a good scab over the, uh, the nail bed and you're back in normal footwear. So the toner here has just been gently lifted, encouraged uh, to be lifted away from the base of the nail bed until it's ready to come off, and here it comes. And what you have here, once the nail's gone, is a nail bed, and either a new nail will grow, or sometimes you just get a very, very thin nail. So this is a really typical ingrown toenail. You can see that the big toe, the skin around it, is pretty red and inflamed, and the nail has begun to sink into the nail itself. This is a real common problem you get with ingrown toenails, they embed within the skin.